Today I'm giving you a quick overview of the essential bar tools and how to use them. I'm also making the hummingbird cocktail. Hi friends, welcome to another video. I am Julian Vernon, the all-inclusive resort mixologist. Let's talk about bar tools. We use a jigger to ensure precise measurement. This ensures consistency in the taste of your cocktail. A cocktail shaker to make shaking cocktail. The ideal cocktail shaker to use at a busy all-inclusive resort bar is the Boston shaker, which consists of the mixing glass and the mixing tin and the 1828 set, aka the tin and tin shaker. This is the cobbler shaker. The cobbler shaker consists of a larger mixing can and a smaller mixing tin with a built-in strainer and a metal cap. The cobbler shaker is more ideal for low volume bars and also for home bartending use. We typically shake cocktails that has fruits, dairies, egg white, to ensure all the components are thoroughly infused. For spirit forward cocktails such as the classical gin or vodka martini and the Manhattan made martini style, we use a pint glass portion of the Boston shaker with the bar spoon to stir the cocktail. In recent times though, the Japanese style mixing glass has become the vessel of choice in most bar. This is the julep strainer. It is intended to be used with the mixing glass only as it is too small for the mixing can. This is the Harton strainer. The Harton strainer serves multiple purposes as it fits perfectly in the mixing glass and also in the mixing can. We use a modern stick to crush fruits, herbs, spices, etc. A commercial blender to make frozen cocktail and the bar knife and the cutting board to prepare fruits and to cut garnishes. So the garnishes that we mostly use at all inclusive resort are lime wedge, lime wheel, half orange slice and pineapple wedge. We also use a fine mesh strainer to double strain cocktails. This is a lemon lime squeezer. We use it to extract fresh lemon or lime juice. A cocktail tastes way better when it is made with freshly squeezed lemon or freshly squeezed lime juice. This is a vegetable peeler. We use it to make citrus twists such as orange, lemon, or lime. And this is how you use the vegetable peeler. Lovely, look at that, voila. And you typically squeeze the rind of the lemon, the orange, or lime inside the cocktail to enhance the flavor of the cocktail. This little tool right here, we call it a channel knife. We use it to make more spiral shape citrus twist. So this is how we use it. And whenever you're using this one, you can hold it directly over the cocktail. And in doing so, the citrus oil will go directly into the cocktail. Voila. It's now time to make the hummingbird. The hummingbird is by far the most popular frozen cocktail at any all-inclusive resort in Jamaica. This is a very tasty cocktail. For the hummingbird, I'm gonna start with half of a banana, one ounce of Appleton Signature Blend Gold Rum, half ounce of coffee liqueur, one and a half ounce of Sangster's Original Jamaican Rum Cream.
three quarters of an ounce of grenadine. We're gonna add some ice to the blender. And now it's time to blend it. Excellent. All right, we're gonna pour the hummingbird in the cocktail glass. Nice, smooth consistency. Perfect portions. For the hummingbird, we're gonna make a simple garnish. For this garnish, I'm just gonna go with a marsquita cherry skewed and a pineapple leaf. Straw inside, and voila, the hummingbird. Let's sample this one. This one is very smooth, a very tasty cocktail, and as I said before, it's a number one requested frozen cocktail in Jamaica. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching. As we say in Jamaica, little more man. <laughs>